Hey gang, welcome back to Let's Tay Dawn of War 2. A Let's Play video for the Dawn of War 2 video game. Alright, we are back. We're looking at retaking the Hamlet at the Argus outskirts. Let's jump in. Sergeant Tarkas. Uh, my neighbor's dog is quite yappy this morning. I think you'll, you'll recognize if you hear Duke bark. He's, his, his, his bark is a little more... Uh, guttural and uh, this this neighbor's dog is a little bit more yappy all right here we go Cyrus to Armageddon in position uh, Batman Uh, Space Marines, heartening news. Avatus, the squad leader who defended the hamlet, is still alive. All right. The orcs incapacitated him, but apparently could not finish the job. Avatus is too stubborn to die. <laughs> so it would seem, Cyrus. An orc guard position stands between you and Sergeant Avatus. Approach with stealth and eliminate the greenskins. All right. Understood. So stealth is activated by the Q button. As you Get in there, and what's this? It's impressive. Let's hit him on the attack. So my my general tactic, what I like to do is. Uh, get in there, either suppress whoever I'm fighting, and then get into close combat. I, I don't think you want to get into close combat first. As uh, anybody who plays the current edition of the game knows, Overwatch and um, Overwatch and stuff, getting, getting shot on your way in is just not fun. So what I'm going to do now is I am going to stealth myself, and then move to the spot. And then I'm going to take this demolition charge, and this is a great way to take out any buildings. Uh, buildings are good if you want to jump into a cover. Demolition charge will bring that tower down. Um, but if you want to just take something down so that no, neither you nor the enemy can use it, then demolition charges are the way to go. Your guards eliminated. Excellent work, Cyrus. Avatus's position is on your tactical display. Revive him so that he may join your attack. Okay, so we're gonna jump in. <laughs> Look at this heavy shooter over here. Oh, that is hilarious. Uh, damn orcs found another pass through the hills. Yes, yeah, so I, I love how you can zoom in and Secure change the and we can deploy change the angle to fill out by holding squads. down the alt button. I mean, it's it's gonna get a little wonky the closer you get, but hey, this was made in. What, a couple years ago, so you know the fact that you can really zoom in and get a, get so much detail is really cool. Heavy weapons. Objective taken. Reinforcements inbound. So the goal is you want to capture these points, and then you'll be able to reinforce your squads if you lose any of them. These little pips next Excellent. to the character profiles are... Devastator squad are back to full strength. They're the amount of men now you have in your squad. The and eliminate those orcs, Commander. So you always want to have the maximum amount of green pips and you always want your guy to be full up. I'm just gonna zerg rush in, cause... Why not? Weapons are great at suppressing, and uh, I think that means that they they don't move as fast and they don't fire back as effectively. Those folks are turning tail. They could be going for help. Stay alert. So we're gonna get in here. Oh, look at this my awesome should set up in heavy cover, wrecked predator. The suppressive fire from my heavy bolter will keep the greenskins pinned. Okay, so I press number four, and then now I'm gonna use this, these tank traps as cover. 
There. Devastators ready to fire. Our heavy bolters are deadly, but they take time to set up and have a limited field of fire. So I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna take my scouts, and I'm gonna move them. Oh, sorry, wrong one. Take my scouts and move them into this building. Take my tactical squad, move them up so I can throw a frag out. So the game is basically that, you just <laughs> keep moving forward, pushing them back, taking taking those strategic points. You got beacons as well as other Commander, there is a second um, other kind of utilities. Your position. Activate it to finish securing the hamlet. When you use items like your frag grenades, um, healing kits, then you're going to need to replenish them, which Excellent is what work, Commander. The I'm doing. Is secure. Yeah. More orcs are on the way, Commander. And then you can see what you refill the attack. This hamlet must not fall again. All right, so I'm gonna put my sniper in the tower. I'm gonna set up my heavy weapons over here, maybe. I'm gonna set up my tactical guys over there, and maybe I'll set my tactical guys over here. Orcs on approach. Come on, greenskins! I guess you can move them, move them around, right? Woo. So much action. You gotta watch out when they throw stuff at you. Oh. Okay, so if he gets a red thing over his head like that, then that means that uh, you gotta go and heal him. Okay, poor Cyrus. He's lost all of his buddies, so... I'm gonna send... Oh boy! Oh, you guys don't waste any time. Besides just your equipment too, my my guy here, my heavy weapon guy has a a mode that you can toggle. Thunderhawks are on approach to return you to the Armageddon. Greatly enhance the damage output, bring ruination to the enemy. And there we go. Two of my guys leveled up, which is great. I got a new piece of armor, improved power armor. So I really enjoy this uh, this game just because it's it's a nice fun distraction. The higher difficulty level you put it on, the more intense it is. I played a lot of it last night, and um, I, I set it to I set one of my profiles to the Primark difficulty, and it was it was pretty intense. And <laughs> so I, I think for this Let's Tay, I'm, I don't want to set it too easily because I don't want to just cakewalk through it. But uh, I don't think I'm gonna go up to the Primark level. We're going to keep it where it is at the Captain level, just so that you can all follow along. And we'll play maybe one mission each each episode, and we'll go all the way through, and then we'll go all the way to the end where we're, um, I guess, leveling up and going through our equipment. And then uh, I think that, that'll be a good format for these videos. There's a new board game that Fa uh, Fantasy Flight released recently where they... It was kind of like a planetary conquest game and I see it in my game store and it has like Battlefleet Gothica kind of ships. Well done, Commander. With the hamlet cleared, we can secure the main route into the capital. The Greenskins knew to strike where we were most vulnerable, Captain Thule. Batman! Cyrus is correct. 
Someone is agitating the orcs and pointing them at valuable targets. If we are going to win this war, we need to find out who is using the greenskins against us. Okay, so you see two more missions popped up. Um, I don't really check up on the blog. And not blog. It's not a blog. It's a. It's like an update thing. Tips. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go in and level up our guys. So when you when you highlight a piece of equipment, it will show you not only what the stats are, but also look on the right the currently equipped one, so you can kind of see what um, what else you've got. Because my guy here, my force commander, is going to be getting getting stuck in all the time. You saw him fall down and go unconscious the last mission. We want him to have the best armor possible. And let's see, for our heavy weapons guys, of course, let's pump the first two points into ranged. Extend the range of all ranged weapons. Awesome. And for our guy here, Cyrus. I, I don't think we ever want them to be uh, melee masters. But, um to move at full speed while infiltrated. So infiltration, the, the stealth ability, it takes up energy when you use it. So I think I'm going to want to max out or at least get, get a lot into energy. But also for everybody, health, I think, is one of the primary things you want to focus on. So I think moving into my next couple of levels, I'm going to pour more points into health. Uh, but I think you want to kind of choose what are your two things. That, Geordi LaForge! What are your two attributes that you want to focus on? So I think energy and health for Cyrus. For Avatus, it's going to be ranged and health. Targets health and, uh, yeah, ranged. And probably health and close combat for my guy here. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed my uh, episode two for the Let's Play Dawn of War 2 video game. And uh, join us next time when we start figuring out which one we're going to go after, Gut Rencha or Sky Killer. Thanks for watching, everybody.